What's going on guys, it's Daily here, and today we're gonna be doing something very exciting. We are going to be comparing a $400 Pokemon Booster Box to a $400 Pokemon Booster Pack. Let's get into it. Okay, so the $400 booster box we're gonna be opening today is XY Primal Clash. One of my favorite XY series, actually. Um, I think it's a pretty fun one. Pretty cool cards in there. You know, Primal Groudon, Primal Kyogre. Um, I think there's a pretty cool Aggron in here, too. Um, but yeah, some pretty neat full art. So if we pull some of those, I'll be very, very happy. Um, we, of course, have 36 packs. Uh, in this to go ahead and attempt to uh, basically defeat a $400 booster pack, which of course has uh, very limited cards. <laughs> you know, 10 booster cards. Oh, oh, skipped one. So we have a Spinda and then an Azumarill. Popping open the next pack here. Torchic, Hippopotas, Surskit, Barboach, Zigzagoon. Hey, there's a Badoof, full reverse hollow and a Ludicolo. I don't even know if you could call that a hit, but it, it is a card. <laughs> it does exist. We did pull it. Either way, we got a Feebas, Ulamus, Ilamus, I don't know, Sigma, Toes, Seedra, and a Wishcash. Not bad at all. Honestly, this uh, entire set is not super expensive yet either for an XY set. I kind of highly recommend going and trying to pick it up. By the way, we're like four packs deep, have not gotten a single hit yet. Energy and a Swamper. You gotta be kidding me, dude. This is um rather pathetic. Alrighty then. Weakness policy and oh, that's a big hitter right there. Oh my goodness, look at that primal Kyogre. Oh baby. That is a smash hit. Got the sleeves here just for this very occasion. Primal Kyogre looking like an absolute beefcake. A little bit of whitening, but not too bad. There you go. Ooh, yeah. Those are the cards I'm talking about. Love those. So that is a big hit right here for this box. All right, but we keep going. Hopefully we can get two of those full arts in this thing. That would be amazing. Lotad, Solra, Kingdra and a Groudon. Very cool card, but not exactly what we're looking for here. Alrighty then, Tangela. Badoof with the Rock. Clam Pearl, Metatite, Tentacool, Macargo, and a Huntail. Hollow, there we go, there's something at the very least. I also like that Macargo a lot. Tangela, Illumis, Torchic, Merrill, Swampert, hey, that's a nice reverse. And, oh, there we go. Primal Groudon EX. This is not the full art version, um, but still kind of a banger card right there. That's a beaut. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, now that PSA isn't too expensive, definitely thinking about getting some of these graded. Isn't it just weird to think that pretty soon X and Y, it's gonna be considered vintage? It's crazy to me that black and white is con considered vintage. And that, that's insane. Groudon Spirit Link and a Sceptile. All right. Meryl, Surskit, Trico, Shroomish, Tangela, and a Rhyperior. At this point, the single Neo Rev pack needs to kind of hold a banger in it. Um, it, it basically needs to have a hollow. Nidoqueen and a Tentacruel. I mean, that's the thing, is you can get a lot of bang for your buck um, with a booster box. However, a single pack is much more of a lottery system. You really need to hit with a single pack versus this where you don't really need to hit as much because you're guaranteed a few hits, you know? All right, Mudkip, Chinchow, Soul Rock, Clam Pearl, Nidoran, Shrine of Memories, and a Starmie with this booster box. We, we've only got technically three hits. <laughs> we've gotten one Hollow and one EX card and one Full Art out of a, a crazy number of packs. It's kind of weird. 
Ooh, but there we go. There's the Primal Kyogre EX. Full art card right there. So now we have the Groudon and the Kyogre. We just need the Groudon full art, which would be a dream. Can you imagine that? Getting all four of those in a single box? That would be nutty, to say the very least. Tangrowth and hey, a Blaziken holographic card. There we go. Hollows really went downhill pretty bad. <laughs> Tense Cool and a Beedrill. Okay. All right, here we go. Weedle, Shroomish, Sfeel, Mudkip, Phoebus, Volbeat, and a Macargo. Drillbur, Skitty, Rhyhorn, Sfeel, Lotad, Zigzagoon, and a Ninetales. Okay, next up, what do we got here, boys? And then, oh, ooh, yeah. Trevenant EX. I actually really like these full arts. Um, I think these are gonna go up in value a lot in the days to come. Well, years to come, probably. Uh, pretty cool full art right there. Definitely not as cool as getting one of the primals, but I still think that's kind of a banger. We'll, we'll see what it ends up pricing out as. Still not sure if I'm gonna use the PSA prices or just, uh, you know, loose prices, but pr probably gonna use loose. Probably gonna use loose pricing, um, just because you can't really guess what something's gonna grade as with PSA, it just makes it a little bit harder. Um, Melotic, hollow, there we go. Hopefully the, the last half of this uh, booster box is going to be semi-loaded, considering the fact that the front half has certainly not been, and I do see something in this. Trapinch, Sfeel, Torchic, Meryl, Surskit, Azumarill, and Mega Agron EX. There we go, not the full art, not the full art, but still a definitely positive hit. I love those agrons. All right, heading into another pack here. Definitely having a little bit more success in the in the second half here. All right, Tentacool, Rhyhorn, Solrock, and ooh, Professor Birch's Observations. That is a trainer full art. That could be worth something. I, I really don't know. I've never actually seen this card before. Um, but I know trainers went really, really sky high for just a little bit, and then they kind of plummeted to the ground. Um, you know, I, I think they are balancing out right about now, but, uh, hip how dawn hollow, by the way. Alrighty then, here we go. Sfeel and uh, nothing. <laughs> Coming down to the wire here for the last few packs, but I mean a very very strong booster box. I will say that Gardevoir EX. Hey, it's not even done yet, baby. Not bad. These XY poles actually kind of good Way better than I thought they would be um, definitely coming in clutch a good bit Seriously though never really thought um, We would get this good of a box here Alrighty then electric and that's that I think we can maybe hope for one more full art. Torchic and a Beedrill. Three more packs, one full art. I think uh, I would be a happy, happy boy, but I'm already pretty happy as it stands. Uh, Volbeat, Metatite, and nothing, okay. Come on, give us something in these last two packs. Just something, something to wet our palate. All right, Nosepass, Spinda, Horsey, Skitty, Tangela, Starmie, and Azumarill. Okay, nothing. Please, last pack magic here. At least something. It, it's the very last pack. I, I feel like it, it, it at least owes us some sort of hit. I'll take a hollow, man. Spinda, Mudkip, Phoebus, Illumis, Hippopotas, Lantern, and Aegislash. Okay, all right, all right. You know what? It was a hollow hit. So. Decent enough um, Primal Clash booster box. I will say the hollows aren't gonna really count for anything, but uh, we did manage to hit a Gardevoir EX, Professor Birch's Observations, Mega Agron EX, Trevenant EX, Primal Kyogre EX, Primal Groudon EX, and a Primal Kyogre EX. Um, pretty decent pulls right there. Let's go ahead and check out the Neo Rev pack. We're gonna be opening up Neo Revelation. It's an unlimited pack here, and I'm pretty stoked about that. Um, Neo Rev, I've only opened once. I've opened one Neo Rev pack in the past. Um, not something you really get to open every day. 
So I'm pretty excited. If you guys enjoy this, please be sure to hit the like button, subscribe if you haven't already, and comment down below. Let's see what we get, baby. Oh, I'm pretty hyped. Um, things are looking good in terms of, I kind of screwed this pack up, didn't I? Let me try going for the bottom. Um, Things are looking good in terms of not being a reseal. Not seeing a lot of glue or anything like that, which is nice. So, we like to see that. All right, we're gonna go, I think it's three. It's either three or four from the back. Not entirely sure. Listed as unweighed, of course. Um, no idea if that's actually true, <laughs> you know. You know how they are. Either way, we got a Lantern. A Sea King, we're getting a lot of fish Pokemon today. And a Balloon Berry. Those are our uncommons. Then we're going into the commons. We've got a Skip Loom, a Staryu, an Unknown. Okay, that's a decent common. The other's not really doing it for us just yet. Uh, I'm not really expecting to get a lot of value out of this pack. It's more just for fun. Quillfish, wow, we are getting, this is the fish pack. Are there any like um, fish type Pokemon you can pull from Neo? Um, maybe a Kingdra, can you get Kingdra? You can get it in a hollow, it, that might be Neo Genesis though. All right, Shuckle. Murkrow, okay, I do like Shuckle a lot. Hey, it's a ya boy, Shuckle. Now, Chin Chow. Wow, we, we really did get the uh, the water Pokemon treatment. All right, here's our rare. No, don't be a trainer. Actually, wait. I'm thinking Skarmory. It is a Skarmory, but um, sadly, it is a non-holo. But that is a beautiful, beautiful, beautiful card to get right there. Neo Rev definitely ended up the loser in all of this. I mean, compare, compared to all these cards we got, uh, we really just got a non holo for Neo Rev. Um, you know, it's tough out here. You can't win them all. And, uh, you know, it's kind of the lottery versus guarantees. And the lottery, believe it or not, lost. <laughs> but guys, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Please be sure to hit that like button if you did. Subscribe if you haven't already. And comment down below uh, for a chance to win. I think we're going to be giving away, we'll give away the Mega Agron EX. All you got to do is comment down below, subscribe with notifications on, and hit the like button and you'll have a chance to win this. All right, guys, I'll see you on the next one. Peace.